Okay, Don Leo will move the couch for you, Jason. We've unearthed. This this is probably about as big as the Jimi Hendrix album that's just been found in Stephen Stills' collection. This is the first day Rock 99.5 went on the air. We've unearthed the tape. And uh, I believe, who is it, Tony? It's Tony. Tony, Tony. <laughs> The best of the 60s, 70s, and today on the new Rock 99. That's Tony? That's Tony. That's Tony. <laughs> That's Tony? Here's another break for you. Playing three decades of classic rock and roll. The best of the 60s, 70s, and today on the new Rock 99. Of course, head games from the best of its foreigner as we give it to you here 15 <laughs> minutes past 4 or 4.15. This is Tony Curry. Coming up, we're going to be taking you home right around 5 o'clock. And plenty of classic rock and roll between now and then, including some Leonard Skinner for you, a rock and roll requisition from them, as well as ZZ Top, a little old band from Texas, and a little Steely Dan for you as well. In the meantime, we've got a rock and roll request for some new bad company. It's No Smoke Without a Fire. New bad new company. New rock and 99. <laughs> new bad. <laughs> you, notice the, you notice the 1988 tape player that I yeah, found to play yeah, the tape yeah, from 1988. Yeah. Isn't it amazing how bar promotions will change the your voice? the 60s, voice? 70s, and today on the new Rock and 99. A19, that's Aretha Franklin, of course, the Dan Band, Steely Dan, again back a few years, 10 minutes before 5. It is 4.50 with Tony Curry. And we're going to have some clear conditions tonight, low near 28s on Thursday, some sunshine in the morning, some uh, He sounds like a different person. Showers by Absolutely. Nightfall. Tomorrow's high right around 58. Sounds like a different it's person. In Birmingham. We're 20 be years of abuse to the vocal cords. <laughs> right, say, Charlie, you made any, uh, so there is your, we, there is well, your sample. That is it. Uh, we probably need to somehow digitally convert that and put it on the web somehow. And that will be done. We are working on finding old audio over the last 20 years. We're going to put it on the website. So we just have to find... A tape player that we can hook up to the right. computers to actually get it uploaded, but we're going to do that and get it up soon. And we have interviews and other tapes from the last 20 years that are going to be on the website soon. So there you go.